I think it's funny when black people are like Asians or whoever are like, they're like, oh, that's, that's, you know, pro cultural appropriation. Like we did that first. You can't do that. You can't have braids. You can't have this. Before we dismantle this pigmently challenged trollop, let us look at the definition of cultural appropriation. Cultural appropriation, noun. The unacknowledged or inappropriate adoption of the customs, practices, ideas, etc. of one people or society by members of another and typically more dominant people or society. So when it comes to the whole stealing part, we can look back at Bo Derek. She was the epitome of what white beauty is. Well, beauty is, it's just, it's not hyphenated. Like American, African American, Asian American, Mexican American, Latino American, like Hispanic. They don't get hyphenated, but that's the hyphen. Okay, anyway, anyway, anyway. The problem is that Bo Derek came out with these things and then decades later kim kartrashian did the same is that they can put this on as a costume and take it off because even with it on they look like they're unique and different when it's sisters it looks trashy ghetto ratchet whatever y'all are trying to you know throw at us these days so then when it becomes trendy and embraced and then we can't go in the workplace with the same hairstyle you did really steal it because you didn't tell everybody that it's okay for everybody to do it and it only looks right on you i'm not trying to steal it from you like i i just admire you I want to copy you. And, you know, the intellectuals will argue that imitation is the most sincerest form of flattery. However, comma, if you're going to imitate and mark us and because you love us so much and you endear with us, then don't just celebrate our rhythm. You should come over here and stop your people for causing us blues. Is that offensive? Because if that's if that's offensive, then you got some issues like you need to stop being some snotty, stupid fucking and appreciate that we're all jealous of you. We're all jealous of you. And at this moment, everybody should realize that she didn't think this through as much as she could have because she listened to it. You know, we do this too. And there's times that we step on stuff and we just delete it or we just run it as it. We do a one take that we're not going back and forth to do this for free. Right. Right. But here's the thing is that she knew that she did something with that by referring to sisters as bees. Like, we don't know how you're telling that you're jealous and envious, because that's what it boils down to is jealousy, because their hair don't grow like ours. Their locks, it looks like the Grinch's finger. Y'all have seen it, right? Right. So here's the point, though. Here's the point. If you're so jealous because you don't appreciate how you were put here, because you're, you're, you were made the epitome of beauty and then you really see it and recognize it and want to do it too. Well, then again, come over to our blues. There shouldn't be a need for Black Lives Matter. There shouldn't, there shouldn't be a need for us talking about voters registration, right? Because if you're so jealous of us, then we should be something to be jealous of with like power here to be protected instead of being gunned down, assaulted, mass incarcerated, job wage gap, the whole not. Anywho, you should know the drill by now. Like this, comment to add value. Send this to your people's follow this account. Good talk. Glad we had it. Eat.